it's always nuts like. So what's the weirdest thing so far meet and greet wise happened? Anyone? Well today? Well, at all really? Well just like people just weird like what I find the funniest right but it happens all the time is people feel like they need to tell me some sort of story before they ask a photo it's like their excuse. They're like, hi, Scotty T. Oh my God, you've met my son. Like, all oh, this and that. Like, and my daughter, I mean, this one time, she loves you. Oh, can I get a photo? It's just like, why are you just saying, can I get a photo? I just go, what do you want? How are you? Know what I mean, like, like, that's all you ask. Or oh, my daughter really loves you. Like, I really want this picture for my daughter. And they probably don't even have a daughter. They probably just want it for themselves, like, on their bedroom wall. You make people nervous. That's so sweet. I don't mind. I just give people butterflies and that. Do you? Uh, no, you're not the only. Well, I'm getting butterflies right now, but ha. Chloe, Elizabeth, she's a. Uh, Getting butterflies from you at the moment? Was. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, well, no, but it's a bit complicated at the minute. I think we might be moving too fast a bit on that one, but there's a couple of uh, underlying issues. Not, not like, not, not, nothing serious, just like, you know what I mean? Because I'm, I'm never at home, so I'm always away. And she's busy and she does her own thing and she's a lot younger, so like, you know what I mean? She's a lovely girl in that light and I love it a bit, but I'm seeing her tomorrow, so. But you sent her an amazing Valentine's gift. Was that not your doing? Which one? The, the cakes and the chocolates and stuff. No, that was just a freebie off a cookie there. <laughs> I did send her something, but she didn't put it on Instagram. <laughs> was it a naked pic? Nah, nah, she doesn't need the naked one, which she's got me anyway. Nice. Okay, so, because I've, I've spoken to you for years and years now, you've never really wanted a girlfriend because you're always going away. No, no, the thing is that that's where everyone like gets us wrong, like, because I actually do want a girlfriend, because I'm, I've, I mean, I've been there, done that, and got every single t-shirt in every single city, haven't I? So, I'm bored <laughs> and I want a girlfriend. I've got a new place, I'm settling down. I just want to chill. You know what I mean? Like, I do love going out and that's the but I just can't be host. Like, but I think I need to just. You know what I mean? Need to chill. Okay, play, play it cool, yeah? I'm just a big flirt and everyone thinks that I, would, I just want to get with everyone, but it's not. It's just what I'm like. Um, also, talking about flirting, I saw your offer to be stepdad to Megan and Wes's hamster. Well, obviously, that was like. <laughs> Bit of a, like a hidden question, one or <laughs> <laughs> Now she's single, really? Okay. So yeah. did you get a, did you get a response? Have you spoken since? Have you stood into I didn't the even DMs? Check, to be honest, like, yeah. <laughs> she's definitely thinking about it though. Is she? Probably. Do you like hamsters? They're Harry. I used to have one called Harry when I was a kid. It was mad. <laughs> <laughs> um, talking about like, Love Island people stuff, stuff like that. Do you find it bizarre that they get that they come out of the island and they're just mega stars? But you know what it is, what I, what I find weird, right, is like <laughs> a lot of them have been trying so hard to be on telly for like years and years and years. And it's like some of the people put on, I just think like, what's going on? Like, but some of the people who like actually do, like they are naturally like quite sound people. But I mean, it's just another show. You know what I mean? It's not, it's not the same. Put majority show that wouldn't last two minutes. Why is that? Because it's not, not the same, it's not the same. Love Island, like, I mean, they're on it for a bit, obviously, like, they're trying to find love. But they could go out, like, complete party every night, you know, and live in a house for five weeks, travel around, get up every morning, you know what I mean? Like, and do it, like, three times a year, travel around all the UK, go around the world. You know what I mean? Like, Love Island is big, but, like, it's fair play to them if they are, but I think a lot of them are going on TV now. A lot of people go on TV just expecting to be famous. It's like, I'm going to do all these interviews and I'm going to be famous. It's like, I never really wanted it, but it happens, you know what I mean? Things have changed a lot from when Geordie Shaw started. Yeah, things have changed a lot, you know, now, and it's like, it just seems to be like anyone, everyone and everyone wants to be on TV. You walk, you walk past the background of someone on TV and you, you verified on Instagram. You know what I mean? It's mad. <laughs> Oh, what? Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah.